Although camera bags are fantastic, and God knows I own many of them, I usually find that their specific nature and design means that they're not great if you're trying to do things other than just photography or videography. To the point where the majority of the time, despite having so many camera bags, I don't actually use them. The majority of the time, I just have a standard backpack. It doesn't have any specific camera focused features. And beyond the laptop slot, it really doesn't have sort of anything in the way of additional protection in it. So in order to keep my equipment safe, um, I use the donkey wraps and I've been using them for many years. Um, pretty good, I own like 10 or 11 of them and beyond buying too many, I think I've got three or four of these of this tiny size, which doesn't fit any of my equipment particularly well, they're perfectly fine. But recently I had a company get in touch called Protego um, who produce camera apps in the UK and I was quite curious to take a look at theirs and see how they stack up against the Domcure apps and see whether if you're in the UK especially or Europe you should be buying them rather than Domcure apps given they've probably travelled a little bit less and perhaps a little more sustainable. So let's take a look at them. So the Protego wraps come in three different sizes. You have the 11 inch, which will set you back 13 pounds or 12.99. You'll have the 15 inch, which will set you back 20 pounds or 19.99. And you have their largest, which is the 19 inch wrap, uh, which will set you back 24 pounds or 23.99. Now, they're very similar to the Domkey wraps in many ways, but in some ways they also differ. So let's first talk about the similarities. They are a square microfiber style fabric on the outside. So it's, it's basically a Velcro uh, friendly uh, fabric. And then on the inside, they're a slightly different fabric, um, which is a bit more sort of tear resistant and so on, gives it some strength. And there's a bit of padding in between, plus nice long Velcro straps. And the length of Velcro straps is actually a bit different to the Domkey wraps in that they're a bit longer, which I actually prefer, gives you a bit more flexibility when you're using them. Now to use them, I mean, it is dead simple, but just to demonstrate, take the piece of equipment that you want to protect, uh, pop it in the center of the wrap and just simply close the Velcro around it. And that's it. Don't get me wrong. At this point, don't go throwing this around your room. It's not going to protect it from that. Um, there is some padding, but it's, it's sort of minor padding. But what this will do is it'll stop your equipment getting scratched. And it's great if you want to chuck it into another bag to stop it from uh, clinking against other equipment or other stuff that you have in your backpacks. It basically means you can turn any bag into a camera bag within reason. Um, I like the material they've used actually, especially on the outside. It does strike me as a bit softer um, than the Domkey wraps, which is no bad thing in my, in my opinion. And as I said, this longer Velcro does give you a bit more flexibility. The, the joy of these things is you can also create pouches with them um, as you come with the Domkey wraps, which again, just means that you can nice and easily sort of have them set up, pop them in your bag, fold it all up and you have protected camera equipment to a certain extent at least. The 19 inch I thought I'd show you actually is big enough to fit even the biggest lens I own anyway, which is the 200 to 500 56 with the F to Z adapter attached because I never remove it because otherwise I find um, I'm suddenly uh, out and about without the actual uh, mount adapter on it, which is always a problem. But yeah, like even this could now go in a standard backpack and I wouldn't need to worry about it getting scratched up or indeed minor scuffs um, from other objects in the bag. They, they really do work very well. I think that the price point is pretty fair. Um, they're a couple of pounds cheaper, especially on the larger sizes than Domkey wraps, which is nice. And when I was speaking to the owner of the company, it seems they do source um, as many materials as they can in the UK. They're as sustainable as possible. They even made in the UK, which I think is pretty cool. Um, I always thought it was quite cool. Um, I said that in the start that the Domkey wraps are made in the US. Um, but them being made in the UK, I mean, if anything, that's even more sustainable because they haven't had to travel as far. Obviously, if you're buying them in the US, that logic doesn't work, but you see my point. So yeah, there you have it. These are the Protego wraps. Um, they come in a whole variety of colors uh, to suit whatever you're into. Um, they sent me sort of their green, red, and black, uh, which works for me. Um, the red one, actually, I have found quite useful because if you wrap something in it, you really do notice where you've left it which um, is quite good for me because sometimes I can miss stuff even when it's in plain sight. Um, but yeah, there you have it, Protego wraps. Um, price point's pretty fair in my opinion. Um, I do think that the, the 15 inch is probably the, the least good value to a certain extent, um, but the, the, the 11 inch is really good value at like 13, 40 pounds, I think that's great. Um, and at 24 pound, the 19 inch size is 
like five or so pounds, six pounds cheaper than the price for the donkey wraps off places like Wex. So that's pretty cool. And you get to support a UK company at the same time, which if you're in the UK does kind of make sense. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. Just a short little video about an alternative to the donkey wraps and a, a nice way to keep your equipment safe uh, when you're out and about and don't necessarily want to use a camera bag. That being said, if you are interested in camera bags, um, I have recently been going through a bit of a phase of trying to find my perfect camera bag and we should have a, at least one video coming up um, talking about that and reviewing the latest uh, Wandered Provoke uh, camera bag too. So keep your eyes peeled for that one. So thank you very much for watching. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions about the Protego wraps, let me know and I will try and answer them as best I can. And equally, um, if you haven't already, do subscribe as that really does help me out. Thank you very much for watching and I hope to see you again next time. Goodbye.